Edo rely on this method to cut away damaged sections and join new pieces of timber. It is difficult to imagine just how the joints fit together by simply looking at the workmanship. This type of joint was developed so that the pillars in a building's corners can be repaired at an angle. One reason the Eido needed repairs was wood rot from leaks in the roof. The section that protrudes from the main roof had caved in due to crumbling support beams. The rotten sections are cut away and new timber is fitted. The old and new timber supports are joined using Tsugite techniques. つなぐっていうことと、上からこう切ったときにずれないとかそういうことを考慮して、この形をいろいろあの経験と相談のもとやっていった仕事です。当初からの仕事を残して、材料もできる限り当初の材料を残して修理していくっていうのがあの文化財
The bark of hinoki, or Japanese cypress, is water resistant, so it has traditionally been used as thatching. This complex undulating roofing made from thousands of bark strips is a prestigious craft used on temples, shrines, and aristocratic houses. Since hinoki is a natural material, the roof easily weathers and becomes moss-covered. Therefore, it needs replacing every 30 to 40 years. The roof of Kiyomizu Dera's Okuno Inn is currently being rethatched. The hinoki bark strips are first submerged in water to make them pliable and easy to handle. The strips are layered to fit the roof's contours. They are then secured with bamboo pegs. The thatcher puts 20 to 30 pegs in his mouth at a time and turns them to point in the same direction. One at a time, he spits them out and pounds them in using a special hammer. This skill requires years to refine. Layer upon layer, the elegantly contoured roof takes shape. A hinoki forest in the north of the city. Bark strippers use unique methods to peel the bark off the hinoki trees. The best material is gathered from trees more than a century old. A stake-like wooden tool is inserted and slid under the bark to remove it without damaging the trunk. The bark strippers climb the tree with a rope, peeling the bark as they go. The tallest tree is 30 meters high, so this can be dangerous work. The bark takes 10 years to fully regrow. Nature's cycle provides ideal building materials. Hinoki bark needs processing before it can be used as thatching. Each sheet is cut into thin strips by hand. The extraordinary task of thatching some roofs requires up to one million strips of bark. One man checks on the progress at Okunoin. Veteran Thatcher Denkichi Inukai, 77 years of age. He worked as a Thatcher from the age of 15 for 60 years, during which time he roofed many national treasures and important cultural heritage sites, including Kiyomizu Dera's main hall. He has lightened his workload in recent years, but he still visits important work sites to give advice.
もうそれは僕らがやってきたこと以上にやってもらいたいですね、残してほしいよね。教科書みたいなものがないので、その現場でやっぱり、自分が失敗して、これはやっぱ違うんやとっていうのをじあの体験して、経験して、教えてもらうっていうのがやっぱり、一番勉強になりますよね。やっぱりそのあの、下のものに受け継いだものを、次また次世代につないでいくっていうのが大事、それで今まで現在があるんですから、みんな頑張ってやってます。With each generation, this forest of giant trees that sustains Buddhist structures grows smaller, endangering the future of traditional architecture. Kiyomizu Dera purchased this land and forested it with Japanese Zelkova saplings to ensure ample materials for future repairs to the stage's pillars. This sapling, planted in 2000, now has a diameter of 10 centimeters. It will be another 400 years before it can be used to support the stage of Kiyomizu. The Furuhara family tends the trees. The forest must be nurtured for many generations to come, and the father and son team dream of the day the trees will fulfill their intended role. Zero から始まるんでね、一が投げれば三百までいかないので、とりあえずはあの毎年ずっと世話をしていけば、まあ三百五十年、四十四百年という時にあのたどり着くわけであって続けていきたいと思っています。Buddhist architecture has watched over Kyotoites for generations and has comforted them in times of need. Maintained and preserved, these temples of worship will always inspire deep faith.